This video will show you how to use Storyblocks' built-in video editor to create videos for social media. So I'm going to show you an example of a YouTube short that I've created all within Storyblocks. The best thing about traveling solo. Traveling solo means getting to know the real you. So that was the YouTube short. Now obviously you don't need to make YouTube shorts, you can make Instagram reels, you can make any videos for social media, you can even make YouTube videos. But once you've signed up for Storyblocks, to get to their editor, go to Creative Tools, and then their editor's called Maker, so click on that. Now once you're inside of Maker, you can then create a new project. Now you can choose a format first, so if you want YouTube videos, that'll be 16 by 9. If you want like TikTok and Instagram Reels, that's 9 by 16, and those are probably the only two you want. So I'm going to create a YouTube short or an Instagram Reel or a TikTok. Okay, so once you're inside of the video editor, it's actually quite simple and very easy to use. On the left here, you've got the search bar and you can search for video or audio. You can upload your own audio or video here. You can change the styles and the text color. You can add text and so on. Now, let's say for example, you had some audio that you wanted to upload. Now I got my audio for that YouTube short from voicemaker.in, which is a text to speech a generator. So I just entered it in here and downloaded it. You can download your own audio and add whatever you want. If you want to find audio, click on audio and you can search for whatever audio you need. I like to add my audio first though and base the video around audio. So I'm going to go to upload, upload media, and I'll upload the same audio that I had before. So we'll get this MP3 file uploaded and we can then upload this file. Okay, so now if we go to uploads and then audio, we should be able to see our audio and we can then drag it on to the video editor here. So now what we can do, we can simply play this audio. The best thing about traveling solo. And you can see that plays. Now here you've got, on the right here, you've got trim clip, you've got the volume and you can fade in and out. So it's always good to fade in and out your audio. You can also kind of like split the audio. So here there's kind of like dead space. So if you wanted to split it, you could click on this split button and then find the other place where you wanted to split it. And then you could delete this middle bit here by clicking delete on the keyboard. And now you've got rid of the dead space. So now let's upload some videos. So if you go to video, go to stock footage. And because Storyblocks has a lot of stock footage, you can search through the whole library. So let's search for travel. We can then go through all of these videos, we can load more, and we can find the perfect video. Now I'll drag this video on here, and you can just drag it straight on. Now let's say we want this video, uh, we can now trim this down, so it's the perfect length, length for us. And we can also move the video so it fits the dimensions and you can center it. You can also add filters, change the opacity, and again fade in this video. It's okay, so that's great, and then we'll add in another video here, this one here. Now I'm going to find the end of this clip and I'm just going to split it and then we'll delete the other end here. Okay, so now we can play our clip. Best thing about traveling solo. Traveling solo means getting to know the real you. Okay, so there you go. And I'm also going to undo this fade out. One last thing I'm gonna show you, you can also add text. So if you go and add text, I'll add the fade in text. You can just drag this on the screen. It will then go into the text box. And you can then customize this. I can then go and add text in the top right here. And I might want to change the size and the color here. And maybe it needs to be two lines. So there you go. You can now center this. And now you've got text animation. So once you're happy with your clip, you want to go to export video in the top right. You can then export up to 1080p, which I recommend, obviously 1080. Click export as 1080. It will then render your project and you can then export it. So that has been how you can use Storyblocks to create videos for social media. That's been a quick overview. I hope that video did help you out.